The easiest and quickest way to program the timeline is by using manual programming. This allows you to add values to the timeline and then play them back to check that you have added and programmed the values that you require. You can either manually select the pen tool up here at the top, or alternatively, you can use the Alt key to change between the cursor and the pen. I prefer this method as the cursor and pen are the two tools you will use the most, and therefore this allows you to switch quickly and easily between them. To use manual programming, simply click on the timeline track and add the values as you wish. As mentioned previously, this is not the most accurate way of programming the timeline, but it is quick and easy, allowing you to add values to your timeline and then play them back to make sure that everything happens as you hope. If you then need to make changes, you can either grab the values manually, like so, or delete them in order to create new values.